Hello guys and welcome to the Dollar Tree Life. I'm really sorry, my first video is going to be a haul. I did do a walkthrough, but the store was so loud, it was extremely distracting. So I'm just going to go through some stuff that I did purchase at Dollar Tree. Okay, so I'm just going to go through some stuff I found in the beauty section really quick, because um, it's really not a lot. So I got these two Kiss Gels. Um, which I was really surprised about because usually every time I go there is none of these But there just so happen to be a lot of the white and red. So I was super excited to get those and these Wow, okay, so Everybody knows flower beauty has hit Dollar Tree, but they do run out really quick when they do receive them um, so I got this which is an eyeshadow cream and it is beautiful like you can't tell because my light is on but it it comes off as kind of mauvey silver but there's definitely an olive and golden undertone in it it's really pretty um this quad i bought two of these um this one is closed the other one i have opened and these are really pigmented and very smooth um, I'm going to throw in a picture of the swatches for you guys of all of these. This is a cream blush. Um, no, it did not come like this. I removed the wrapper just so I could test it out and it's really pretty. So I'm going to insert a photo of swatches of all of these. Okay. Um, I get my nails done so I needed a nail file so I went and bought this one you know it says professional quality so I will be testing it out to see how good it is I'll let you guys know all right and I'm really really excited for this um, so this I found on an end cap. It wasn't in the actual aisle with the rest of the hair products. So this is for edges or baby hairs. And I just so happen to have a lot. So I was really excited when I found this. It comes with this brush end here. And then this, oh sorry guys, this comb end here. So. I will be testing it out if you find these I would grab them um, just because this is the only one I found left at my Dollar Tree okay so this is more of like the health section um, I guess the medicine <laughs> you know that um, aisle in Dollar Tree so they do have a lot of the hauls um, the mini ones the 14 drops they have these honey cherry and that blue packet but I really like these, so I picked up um, two of these, um, one I have at my office and one I just carry in my bag. Okay, now these. I swear by these. Okay, so you know how a uh, Vix brand has something like this. It's basically a nasal inhaler. I don't like them this I love um, so it's made with natural mint oil clears airways when breathing relief of nasal congestions due to cold packed with natural essential oils and non medicated and this is so good so I don't have to shove anything <laughs> up my nose to get the relief that I need from this it is very strong but it works I actually purchased four um, one I gave to my boyfriend, the other I have, and then I have these two as backup. So if you see these, I would get them. I definitely would. Um, I bought a chest rub because, you know, uh, it's getting a lot colder here in Jersey. So cold and flu season is upon us. So just in case, I brought one of these. And Brand Alert Cured had... Um, my Dollar Tree had these so I purchased two of them in black um, so it's just a compression and support wrap so I bought this for a couple reasons um, mainly for my boyfriend who does a lot of walking for work I bought these for him so I purchased two of them there was only three left and I didn't want to clear everything out so I just grabbed two um, 
so that's that and then I got these so there are times where I do have trouble sleeping at night but these help with that and these are not strong at all it's only 1.5 milligrams of melatonin but it does ease me into my sleep a lot better and I don't feel groggy in the morning when I do wake up even if I don't have a full eight hours which is really really good so I highly highly recommend these for anybody who does have issues falling asleep okay so I went into their food section and I did grab more than what I'm showing you I'll insert a picture of the other things that I purchased it's just that those were for my boyfriend his snacks and stuff for work um as well as some frozen stuff that he would eat just real quick on the go stuff so they had um the kingsford brand lemon pepper seasoning and the cajun style all-purpose seasoning so I picked up one of each, and these are both good until 2025, so the expiration date on them is really good. I also picked up the Hungry Jack Hash Brown Potatoes. I got two of these. Um, my Dollar Tree just so happened to have a lot of them. I never tried these before, so what I did was I just grabbed two. Um, you know, I'll use one, and if I don't like it, I'll give the other one probably to a friend or my mom or something. these I love <laughs> so I'm vegan right um my boyfriend is not I am so it's interesting here <laughs> not that he wouldn't eat vegan food with me because he usually does eat everything that I do make but Dollar Tree actually has a surprising amount of vegan options and if you want I can actually do a video on that for you guys so they have these sun-dried tomato halves which I really like to use in pastas so I've obviously already opened it but they are really good um, they don't have a funny taste or any, like, anything like that when people find out that I got it at Dollar Tree they're usually really surprised but as you can see they are vegan and that's the expiration date on it so really good expiration date um, it's already pretty much done so it's not bad. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to call this part the randoms of my Dollar Tree haul. Um, just because they don't all fit in a very specific category. So first thing is this Gardley London soap in pumpkin cream and cinnamon. So this soap actually smells really, really good. But I don't recommend using it for your body especially if you have sensitive skin this is more of a decorative hand soap for your bathroom for when guests come over they can use it obviously but i would more so use it for that not for my whole body sorry this glare i'm so sorry guys so next is this deck of black panther cards so my dollar tree actually had quite a few of these um you know, with Christmas coming around, they are getting a larger shipment of Marvel things. Um, but I got this, obviously. My boyfriend and I are big fans of the movie. And when I saw them, I was just like, we need these. <laughs> we do play card games as well as board games. And I knew this was something that he would definitely love. So I had to pick this up. The Crafter Square by me is relatively small, but they did have the glue sticks. I haven't seen a glue gun yet. I know that they came out and I'm really excited for when my Dollar Tree does get them. But I purchased these for when I do my little arts and crafts. And honestly, 20 pieces for a dollar is not bad at all. My Dollar Tree was stocked with these wet wipes, right? And I was super excited. So I only grabbed two because like I said, I don't like clearing shelves especially during the pandemic like everybody's gonna want some of these and I honestly do have some at home that I can use but when I saw these I figured why not get them they're only a dollar um I can give one to my boyfriend for him to have in his car and then I can carry one with me as well um 
but and I never grabbed the first of anything and this is exactly why <laughs> when they opened the box they sliced the packaging you can see it but I'm still gonna use them I just put them in the Ziploc bag but that's a really good reason as to why you shouldn't grab the first of anything and I usually don't I was just really excited when I saw these um so check your local Dollar Tree because mine just so happened to get a huge shipment of these next Dollar Tree socks now I usually do not purchase Dollar Tree socks do they have cute patterns yes absolutely but I feel as though they're really thin and I don't like really thin socks um but I saw these thermal quarter socks and these are actually quite thick um, I bought two of these I wore one already and it act they actually feel really good my feet were warm I didn't think they were too thin so if you happen to see these you should definitely pick them up because I thought they were great I also purchased these these are the 30 total wipes in here so I believe it's 15 in each uh, two travel packs yes two 15 count packs now um, I didn't buy these for me specifically I am going to be doing blessing bags so if nobody knows what blessing bags are they're bags that you fill with certain uh, necessities and when you see someone in need you just give it to them so I want to get back to doing that and especially during this time I know that there's gonna be a lot of people in need so I am gonna be doing a Dollar Tree haul on um, things that I get from Dollar Tree for blessing bags so keep an eye out for that but I bought these this was the only one that I had saw so this is the only reason why I only bought one so these are definitely gonna be put towards blessing bags and I had already spoken to the manager at my local Dollar Tree and asked if she would be getting more of these and she said yes um, in her next shipment so I will be going back to grab a couple more Colgate <laughs> so I really like Colgate toothpaste I don't really like any other brand of toothpaste so I got this one it's only a dollar you know which isn't bad um, I usually get another one that they get in uh, the one in the blue box um, but they didn't have that one so I just grabbed this one it's toothpaste it's gonna all work the same honestly so and it's not bad for a dollar this is the last part of the random section the aroma diffuser so these were flying off of shelves in Dollar Trees. Mine just so happened to have quite a few left over. Now, I bought these for my office, one for home office, one for my office at work. My boyfriend and I do own a candle company, so we have plenty of <laughs> essential oils and things like that. And, you know, sometimes we just have Plenty that are left over and we don't have a real use for them anymore so anything that we do have I feel like we can use in these um, which is great you know it we be reducing waste and also you know our places will smell nice so I definitely picked up two of these like I said there were plenty more there but like I said I don't like clearing shelves I don't think that's nice so got two Okay, so this is a very tiny part of my Christmas um, stuff from Dollar Tree just because I really didn't have enough time and so I will be doing a separate Christmas haul as well, but I'm starting with these. So, um, I will be doing a small Christmas village and so I saw that they had a post office so I definitely had to grab that as a joke for my boyfriend. Um, and he saw it and it did make him laugh so it was great um, and I did get this photo prep kit so I had to buy that and it was only a dollar so you can't beat that look at all of these that's amazing for a dollar now anyone who knows me knows that I love Batman so um, they had this one and this one so I usually have a Batman on my Christmas tree. My Batman ornament broke, so I will be making one of these into an ornament and one of them will be in my Christmas village. So, 
how I will incorporate it, I'm not sure. Um, I think this one is going to be in my Christmas village though this year. And then this one, I think I'll put on the tree. We'll see how it works out. Okay, and every single year, all of my gifts are always wrapped in Batman paper. My Dollar Tree just so happened to have two different ones. So these are them. And I thought they were really cute. And for a dollar, I mean, come on, guys. You really can't beat that. It's only a book. So I highly suggest going to your Dollar Tree for wrapping paper. Um, I know that they've been getting in the Hallmark ones, um, like at 20 square feet, some of them. Um, so I think that's great. Oh, these are Walmart. And, ugh, Walmart. I'm sorry guys these are hallmark expressions and these are 20 square feet so definitely going to dollar tree it's super inexpensive all right guys this is the end of my haul thank you so much guys for watching please like comment and subscribe um i will be doing several haul videos please let me know which one you would like to see next on the channel whether it's the vegan food haul the blessing bags one or the christmas decorations one um whichever one you guys would like to see the most um i will definitely be doing next please like comment and subscribe i will be doing giveaways at least once a month so um not this video the next video i'll be doing a giveaway so it'll be a dollar tree gift card and some goodies that i find at the dollar tree that i think you guys would love Thank you so much for watching.